In this video, the region between the curve y equals 5 take away the cube root of x, the y-axis and the lines y equals 1 and y equals 4 is rotated through 360 degrees about the y-axis. Find the volume of revolution which is formed. OK, so we know that the volume is going to be equal to the integral between 1 and 4 of pi x squared dy. OK, so what we need is we need x squared and this is what we currently have. So I'm going to need to rearrange this. So first of all, I can write x to the 1 third is equal to 5 take away y. Now, I need to get x squared, remember. So if I uh, cube both sides, I'm going to get x equals 5 take away y cubed. But I still now need to get x squared. So I'm going to square both sides. Now, I could have done to the power of 6 both sides here, OK, straight off the bat. This is really just to demonstrate us getting there. So x squared equals 5 take away y to the power of 6. So this is going to be equal to the integral between 1 and 4 of pi times 5 take away y to the power of 6 dy. So... What I need to do is I need to either integrate this by substitution or I can reverse the chain rule, OK? So to reverse the chain rule, what I think about is having y, 5 minus y and add 1 to the power because I know that that's going to be part of the process. Now, if I differentiate this with respect to y, I'm going to get the 7 coming down to the front the derivative of the inside is minus 1 coming outside, and 1 coming off the power. So actually, if that differentiates to that, then this must integrate to minus 1 seventh of that. OK, so that's the way that I think through those. So I'm going to bring the pi outside of the integral, and I'm going to have minus 1 seventh 5 minus y to the power of 7. Evaluated between 1 and 4. So, we have pi times. Now, I need to substitute in the 4. So, we've got, well, 5 take away 4 is 1. To the power of 7 is 1. So, we have just minus 1 seventh. Then, substitute in the 1. We're going to have minus 1 seventh times uh, 4 to the power of 7. So that's minus 1, 6, 3, 8, 4 over 7, like that. So minus 1 seventh, take away that, times by pi, will get us 16,383 pi over 7. And so that is the exact value I'm looking for.